Hey yo, what up everybody? It's your boy Lankway Warrior Kamal, and I am back with another video. And uh, and I am going to be reading from this book right here. My little sister. If uh, reading from this book, my little sister bought me. Shout out to her. And the chapter I am going to be reading is called "The Promise of a New Day." I don't know if you have ever been at a crossroads like the one I faced. I vividly remember the moment in my life in August 1980 when I had reached the end of my career as a football player. I remember standing in the locker room after my final release with an enormous amount of concern for the uncertainty I was facing, wondering what was next. I had always played football, and now that seemed to be over. I had been blessed to receive a football scholarship to the University of Minnesota at a high school, and after playing out my eligibility and getting my degree to play for three years in the National Football League, those opportunities seemed to easily follow one after the other. And now I face what definitely seemed to be a new phase in my life. And I wasn't at all sure what path I was to follow at heart. All been so easy up to that point. Each opportunity heart seemed almost pre-selected for me. I would continue to play football and then it was over. Needless to say, it created a couple of anxious and sleepless nights for me. In my better moments, I knew God was in control and had a plan for the first time in my life, though I didn't know what it was. Little did I know that God had 28 years of football coaching in store for me. Young people confront this dilemma a lot. They finish high school and then college, but what's next? It's hard for them to see beyond the uncertainty of the next day. After a major disappointment or setback, it's hard for them to see the bright side. The future may seem murky or at worst bleak, but tomorrow is a completely new day. God promises that he has each of our days firmly in his hands.